Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here, back with another video. And in this one, we're going to be going over a new game here, My Hero Ultra Rumble. Now, this is actually a new Battle Royale game, which is for free right now, and you can download it here on PlayStation, and I do believe Steam here pretty soon. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can unlock all of the characters in the game. So, as you can see here, there's a bunch of different characters on both heroes and villain side that you can play as. But, as you first get into the game, you're going to notice that a lot of them are locked. Now, to begin, you're going to have these three characters here to, be, to play as. You're also going to have some characters down here with assault and support characteristics. Now, if you come down here, you're going to have a few more characters on the villain side that you can use. Now, right when you get in here, you'll be able to actually unlock one of these characters. But the only ones you're going to be able to unlock are ones that were in the beta here. So if you do use your token, you can unlock one of these three characters. Now, keep in mind, guys, these tokens will go away. You only have one that you get for free. After that, you will have to buy the rest from the shop. So if you're not going to buy more in the shop, just be careful when you choose which one you want to use. Now, there's also the trial tokens that you can use. So you'll be able to go in here and actually test out certain characters before you use those tickets if you want to go and use those. But you only have about three of those that you can use before they go away as well. Now, in order to begin unlocking some of the other characters in the game, what you will need to do is come over to this roll tab. Now, you'll be able to exchange either 10 tickets at a time or 100 tickets at a time, just depending on how many you want to pull. Now, I suggest just doing the 10 at a time. Now, the reason why you want to roll these is because, as you can see here, you will have a chance at getting the characters, at least a few of them here in these packs. So as you pull these packs open, you will have a small chance of actually unlocking one of those characters. And unfortunately, those packs are the only way that you can unlock a few of these. Now, one good thing is that if you do not unlock those characters after rolling a bunch of packs, you can come in here into this exchange tab. Now, you'll earn these exchange points for rolling packs. So every time you roll some packs, you're going to get a few points. And every time that you build up to about 200, you'll be able to unlock some more characters. Now this may seem really annoying, but it really doesn't take that long. And all you have to do is, is simply play through the game, get a few wins if you can, and you will simply start earning these points that you can then turn in and get these characters. So it will take a few hours for sure, but it's not impossible at all. So that is how you will unlock those three characters. Now there are actually a few more characters in the game, and you will have to go another route to unlock those. Now those characters will take a bit more time to unlock, but I'm sure they'll be more worth it once you do unlock them. Now, in order to unlock those characters, what you'll have to do is come over here into the License tab. Now, this is essentially like your Season Pass tab, and this portion here will reset every season. Now, if you come up here to the top, you'll notice that there's a section called Special, and you can very easily swap the Battle Pass over to the Special section. Now this is where things change because this special section will never go away. And as you can see here, as you level up this special battle pass, you will actually unlock a few more of the characters. So the rest of the characters will unlock through here. Now this definitely will take quite a bit of grinding to get, but as you can see here, as you progress all the way up to level 30, you will be able to unlock all of the rest of the characters. So if you guys were just curious how you were gonna unlock these, wondering how you can get them for free because you don't want to end up spending a bunch of money trying to unlock them. This is how you will unlock them. So it will take a bit of time. And this is the route to start grinding them out. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it helps you out. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.